We're at Harrison Middle School right now, and we're doing a, it's something called the Mural Project that they started with five schools here in Albuquerque. I am the lead artist for this project here at Harrison Middle School, working with Warehouse 505 and Boys and Girls Club. We are creating this piece that is student designed. Once it started, like kids were really kind of standoffish. There was new people coming in, they didn't know how to handle it. Once they like figured out that they were gonna be designing it by themselves and actually hands-on painting it, they loved it. For the theme, we decided to go with uh, Spider-Man with our own multiverse about the New Mexico. We talked about what we like about Spider-Man. Superheroes being helpful was kind of what we led to and we were just trying to celebrate people that are being helpful. Those were student designed and led. I'm kind of just putting it together to fine tune things. It was like a really cool theme to choose. When the kids are connecting and building community together, talking about how we collaborate, how do we work together to create something that's really beautiful, that's something you're gonna have to do in everyday life. We watched a little Spider-Man also, and we really liked that it was uh, really colorful. It gave us a lot of options to just kind of change this cafeteria around and make it a little bit more colorful place. Older schools like this, we don't have a lot of art. The kids don't see a lot of color, so bringing that into the school is amazing. We talked a lot about our area and things that they're facing. The spider universe created by these students is going to also kind of be combating these other elements they're facing on the everyday that maybe we don't see, that maybe kind of helps to acknowledge why it's toxic to our community and these kids particularly. I've seen a lot of like youth that are influenced in different ways. Some that want to pick it up and actually make it their career. Others as just a hobby to like just survive day to day as like a therapy thing. I really find that very important. Honestly, my first time because like I never done this and usually I'm always saying that my dad do it and so I, I just wanted to try it out. Since last Friday till now, this image looks entirely different. I think it changes the mood for students that are participating or not participating. They're just vibing out on it. There's a lot more interaction. Right now I'm just wearing good art skills I could use to help me in the future. You learn like how to like, work with others. The mural has grown more since. Today was probably more participation than it was last Friday. So it keeps growing and I think the more colorful this piece gets and the more loud it gets, the more excitement it is. Murals are magic in that sense. Just having an artist come and letting the kids see him do his work, it really makes them appreciate the work and art, helps them get a new perspective on life. I think we just need more people to be supported in these roles. If they look like you, even more cool. I didn't see many artists or many teachers that look like me or encouraged me or told me that I could be a muralist or a painter. I wasn't the best student in middle school or high school, so something like this would have highlighted what I also could do and made my self-confidence even boosted a little bit more. So I think these programs are necessary. We need to invest in more arts, more music, more theater. We're already seeing the consequences of what we do when we take away our creative aspects. This program really touches on social emotional learning, which isn't always touched upon in our classrooms. Art contributes to academic success in so many ways because it teaches young people how to advocate for themselves, how to tell a story through, you know, a creative expression. It allows them to be creative, it allows them to have an outlet. It opens up the community. Um, I mean, working with like local artists, bringing them to schools to actually hands-on like work with the kids is amazing. I think it's exciting just to also envision myself that I would be excited to be part of a program like this. So hopefully there's more programs that can keep continuing like this all over the state and, you know, in our systems.